What is up everybody? Welcome back to the channel and welcome to what is in the first time in a long time a brand new Saints Row 2 Rise to the Top video. So guys, in today's video I'm going to be covering how to get the attack military chopper in Saints Row 2. So that is the chopper that you use in the um in the what are they called missions um i don't remember the heli assault missions it's the one that's the fastest it's got the most armor can take the most damage it's got mounted guns it has got missiles it is by far the best um the best helicopter in the whole game and getting it and putting it in your garage is possible but there's a little bit of a trick to it and i'm going to show you today how to uh, how to do that so the first thing you want to do i'm right here at my um, Saints hideout crib. So the first thing I'm going to do is grab a helicopter out of my already existing selection and go down right here. Now this is where the police station is in Saints Row 2. We're going to go to that part of the map and I'm going to show you guys how to grab the, um, how to grab the military attack helicopter once you get there. So here we go. So here's the police station, guys. So I'm going to land right here in the middle of the street and hopefully not get a wanted level because I'm right here near all these cops. Okay. Yep, that somehow by some miracle worked. Okay, so if you go here to the police department, you'll see on the left-hand side, there is a vehicle dealer um, called the Impound Lot. Now, I don't know if this is just in the modded PC version of Saints Row 2, which is what I'm playing. I'm playing uh, the PC version of the game with the Gentleman of the Row mod. And I don't know if this is just a new store that was introduced in the mod, or if that's on all the versions of this game just the console version but the reason i'm showing you is i want to illustrate you can get the helicopter straight from here so right here you can see we have the tornado that was actually what it's called not the titan it's the tornado but you can see you can buy the tornado right here straight from the dealer and in this beautiful yellow color no less but the problem with that is look at the price tag it's two hundred thousand dollars now me i only have eighty eight thousand dollars and it takes a long time to save up two hundred thousand dollars in this game so you could buy it if you had that kind of money if you want to but there is a way to get it for free it's a little bit more trouble but you can do it and that's what i'm going to recommend you do so what you want to do is you want to go inside the police station right here you can either go to the left or the right i'm just going to go to the right that doesn't really make much difference and we're going to go over here to the conference rooms and then right here we have our stairs so we want to go up the stairs to what I believe is the third floor. Okay? So hold up. Third floor. There we go. All right. So if you look here on the sign, it says the detective bureau is over there. And over here is the helipad. So you want to go out here on the helipad. And looky there, boys. A tornado attack military chopper just right here, right for the taking. Now, I have heard that sometimes it's not here. I have personally never found that to be the case. If I don't have it and I come here, it's always been here for me, but some people have said it's not. So make of that what you will. Um, but if it's not here, I guess wait a while and then come back later. But for me, it's here. So I'm gonna go ahead and take it. But do note that when I do, I can only, it's gonna be difficult to get it home because the moment I step in this and start flying it, I'm gonna get, immediately get a five-star water level for stealing a military helicopter from the police. And it's weird they would have that on top of a police station, a military grade helicopter. But look at that, see there, five stars five stars so what i'm gonna do is try and quickly fly it over to my crib oh see here's another one here's another helicopter coming but see right there i can use my missile against it see you can use bullets on on these semi trucks down here look at that look at that boys well i didn't really do a whole lot of damage but my aim wasn't that good okay so anyway so they're doing their best to come after me but they really they i really only just had that one chopper i had to deal with okay so here's my helipad so what i want to do okay here's another helicopter Okay, okay, that would have been a little close. All right, let's land this safely. Uh-oh, there's the FBI, of course. Oh, crap, there's a missile. Okay, okay. Yeah, but you really want to be careful that you get in there on that correctly the first time around. Now, the problem is now I'm just about dead um, because, you know, there's police that are chasing me. So I'm just going to go down here in my little hideout and, uh, and wait for that to end. Alrighty guys, so now our wanted level is gone, so what I'm gonna do now is go up here to my garage and check it out. And looky there, tornado is right there in your garage. You can take this out and use it whenever you want to if you destroy it. And just go back to your garage and get it out again. And yeah, it's got guns, it's got missiles, it's like the most, the ultimate powerhouse for aerial combat vehicles. Like look how, hold up, I'm gonna turn the radio off real quick. 
Look how fast this thing is compared to like the Horizon. Like look at it, it's incredible. The handling is way better. It's just the best helicopter in the game to have and you definitely want to have it in your garage. If you're planning on doing the, um, hold up, let me pull them up if I can. And our diversions. If you're planning on doing the barnstorming diversion, which I do recommend you do, um, then this is definitely the best helicopter for it because that one requires a lot of handling. I've tried doing it in the past with like the little helicopter, which I don't even remember what the name of it is. That helicopter is really not good for barnstorming, but this one definitely is. So yeah, um, that's basically the video, guys. Hope you all enjoy it. I will be giving you um, tutorials in the future about um, all the different barnstorming locations and how to use this helicopter to keep from receiving fall damage in, uh, in Saints Row 2. But that's going to be its own dedicated video. So thank you all very much for watching. I do appreciate it. We will be having more Let's Play episodes of Saints Row 2 coming up soon because we're going to be finishing our Rise to the Top series, doing all these side activities, the main story, all that awesome stuff. But yeah, appreciate you guys tuning in. Hope you all enjoyed it. Till next time, this has been Saints Row 2, a Rise to the Top. I am your host, Cascarte de Utica. Until next time, I will see you all at the top. I, I, I,